From this day forward, the player's way views get ranked by the Infinity Gauntlet. One. I haven't thought this through. We've got four different colors that I can actually like move, like do it out. <laughs> and I'm actually kind of scared wearing this right now. Bro, what the hell? What's happening boys and welcome to the team of the season moments I believe 89 Hatem Ben Arfa one of the channel legends uh, One of the legends of FIFA more so uh, Tots Ben Arfa celebrating his impressive brace against Angel so um, Obviously Hatem Ben Arfa one of those storied players I know Kazooie and Danny R9 Rai are fapping in their seats right now fapping in their DX racer seats right now Because he is one of the more storied skillers in all of ultimate team didn't have a great uh, didn't have a great a uh, card to start this year as a matter of fact if we go over and take a look at this Ben Alpha who is now up there with the other Ben's he shifted as a 79 got an 82 rated in form got an 86 Carnivaler card uh, and then now has an 89 team of the seasons moments card and someone said more like Ben asthma with that stamina 59 stamina is that correct <laughs> plus 10 rating from his base card, but only plus 8 stamina. This is what's wrong with the rating system in FIFA. And this is, I hope, is something that is addressed in FIFA 20. Individual stats can't be adjusted. Surely this card. I mean, if we go back to a, a previous version of Haten Ben Marfa, let's go to, I mean, let's go back as early as FIFA 16 PSG Haten Ben Alpha. We can't see the stats for that. I don't know what his stamina was in previous FIFAs because we can't see, but EA are not able to, at least uh, as part of how they're upgrading stats this year, you're not able to go into a specific stat, as we can showcase right here, and adjust that 59 stamina, which looks absolutely horrible and probably is a reason why this was such a cheap 89 rated card. Uh, I think I did him for about two, uh, 20,000 coins. If we refresh right now, I think it's around 100. Yeah, 180,000 coins. If it's going for 180k right now, I don't even need to get that Infinity Gauntlet out to tell you that that 59 stamina is absolutely crushing. Now, in terms of cam stats, looks like maybe that's the only place you can play him. Um, he does have 82 finishing, but that's not great at all if you're looking him, uh, if you're looking forward to him as a guy that can do stuff in the box. We'll find out. He does have 88 composure, however. Uh, Hawkeye, we want to boost his sprint speed a little bit, so we are going to fix that. And I want to see what 81 aggression and then 80 strength and as well as 96 jumping does uh, with the Hawkeye chem style. Obviously, we've adjusted the pace. The shooting and that physical but Hatem Ben Arfa's 89 rated card um, deal wise again that 59 stamina is kind of tough you get a couple packs back in the form of a mega pack and then a rare electrum players pack so the pack value is actually not half, de uh, half bad but that 59 stamina is just going to be that glaring weakness we're going to see how he looks literally looks like he's going to be chugging by the end of the first half but we're going to find out in this game uh, in a couple games whether or not he is worth it whether or not he's usable to be honest with you we're going to surround him with a bunch of Liga and talent if this epi does per usual boys help you figure out if you do want to do a Ben Alpha if you don't want to do a Ben Alpha drop a like on the video if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button down below now I said that we were going to drop him into a squad we've got that Bamba we've got the Tots League Unguaranteed player who we packed yesterday in the form of that Marco Verratti who looks very very good to be honest with you doesn't have any shooting stats but we're gonna have him on stay back while attacking and see what he can do as a defensive player we've got Memphis Depay who we're gonna play out wide as a as our right mid and then Bamba because we did pack him as our um, in one of our guaranteed 81 plus packs now up top we've got Awar so two shortish guys so this is gonna be an interesting little experiment 510 and then uh, and then 59 I mean like not super super short right but we could technically bring on Jinyak so I'm thinking maybe we see how Hatem Ben Arfa plays as a uh, left striker Right, because he's got the four-star weak foot, five-star skill moves. Uh, Hatem Awar can, uh, sorry, uh, Husem Awar can obviously play wherever because he's got the uh, the four-star, four-star as well. But if Husem Awar, if, if we're balling in a game, I might bring on Geniac because I feel like we let him down a little bit and represented him uh, improperly. Represented him yesterday, Zeppi, but or maybe he just really was uh, not as good as advertised. But we're gonna get into a couple matches here. We're gonna see if that Hatem Ben Alpha is as good as his stats indicate, but we're also going to see how quickly it takes that 59 stamina to come to an effect. Match number one, Alex.
Es Wikipedia. Is it, is it up there? Is the... Is the... Oh, bro. Hatem Ben Arfa. How does that ball end up that... That didn't even go off anyone. How does that go that high, bro? By the way, Bana Brothers is reuniting tonight on Mixer. We're going to be playing PUBG. I'm... For those of you guys that don't know what Bana Brothers is, you're in for a wild ride. You're in for a very, very wild ride. OR. He's been one of the best, and I said it when I did the epi, he's been one of the best, like, value, non-value cards that we've got all year. 95 uh, freaking uh, Hatem OR. 500k, are you kidding me? Someone in the chat yesterday said that he got him done for 80k. That's insane. Oh my god. I'm gonna try and value this as a, an average FIFA player, which I feel like I, I, maybe I'm above average. You know, like gold two, I would say he's definitely above average. He's not a leader or anything like that. That, Luis Suarez, you son of a gun. more than that 82 finishing would indicate. Hatem Ben Arfa with the absolute in-the-box blast. Uh, ben Arfa, 89 rated. Let's see what he's got. More like Ben... A oh, yeah, Ben Asma, we already read. <laughs> God, that's so bad. So, a plus 10 rating from base card, but only plus 8 stamina. He hey, I can now last three more minutes. It'll be good till halftime. That's what I thought, right? Way too expended, uh, expensive for such an underwhelming upgrade at this stage of the game. I mean, I wouldn't go ahead and say an underwhelming upgrade. 86 to an 89 rated card, 123 total in-game stat. Um, a lot of the SBCs that we've gotten have had less than that, so I wouldn't say exactly it's an underwhelming upgrade. I would say the underwhelming part is the fact that he's got 59 stamina. Yes! Let's go! I was half expecting his defender to save that. That's happened so many times in Ultimate Team this year. All right, the moment of truth, boys. What's his stamina looking like at halftime right now, okay? 59 stamina. Compare that to his 86 rated card. And it has 56. <laughs> Verratti is looking over at him like, bro, I'm so sorry that they, they did that to your eyebrows. Um, 36 and 45th minute. So nice goals from, uh, from Hatem uh, Ben Arfa. Awar and Ben Arfa playing very, very nicely together. But the question, like I said is to be determined what is the stamina looking like. And look at that, it's the lowest of any player right now. Wait, what does Varati have? Because he looks like he is about the same as Varati, so it doesn't look horrible. See what I mean? Like, it happens in real life, but I feel like it happens a little bit too frequently in FIFA 19. Like, defenders... Stop it, nice. And I'm messaging Toby, dude. Is that too cheeky? Is that too cheeky for Mo Bamba? Oh, At this point in every epi, you're expecting to hear, and I don't even need to say it, but you guys are thinking it. Where's the America's Funniest Home Video soundtrack? I hope you don't hear it in this epi. I hope that I hope this is one where you don't hear it, because it's been playing a lot lately. See? Nah. When Carvajal's catching up, I mean, that's probably his 87, but... <laughs> I had a pretty decent first showing, I'm not gonna lie. He gets himself, uh, Awar gets 9.4. Look at Husam Awar with the 24 out of 25. Absolute mad lad. Fitness minus 5. So he only dropped one more fitness than Varati. He dropped two more fitness than Awar. F he felt a little sluggish, I'm not gonna lie. He did feel a little bit sluggish there towards the end of the first half. Was it game-breaking? I didn't necessarily feel that. Let's get into another match. Let's focus a little bit more specifically on how his performance and speed feels in the second half. Let's get into match number two. Alez. <laughs> Okay, well, I thought that was 100% going in. Pace, PK. You got embarrassed PK in the process, Mo Bamba, come on. Ah, you want to know what? Uh, with a card like Ben Alpha, it's almost like not, like I almost don't care. I don't care about scoring, finishing the goal. 
as long as I look sick with the skills. A lot of people think I'm trolling about the PK thing, but I actually uh, dated Shakira when I was an intern on the, um, on the Hips Don't Lie set. Like, we dated for, like, two weeks, and then PK showed up on set, and then the rest is history, but, you know. Penal! <laughs> Era penal! Sergio Ramos! Pika getting absolutely megged is accurate, and then Sergio Ramos picking up a yellow is the most accurate thing I've seen. All right, here we go. Uh, what does he got? Ben Affa has 99 pens. Hey, get in. So we're going to go right, and then we're going to go right up the middle. Is this Wikipedia? Um... There we go! Come on, Ben Alpha! Oh, that speed, though! Yo, he's got some pretty sweet speed, I'm not gonna lie. He's got speed that feels... Dude, honestly, this, this Hawkeye chem style really feels like it's injecting him with a little bit of pace. Again, that's one of the more deceiving stats, right? It says 87 pace here. Like, oh, he's probably pretty fast. But 82 sprint speed? Definitely want to slap something on him that gets his, uh, you know... If you're playing him at Cam, or if you're playing him at, at Rammer, or even Lamb or something like that, you definitely want to put probably the engine. There we go. Beautiful. That's, that's what we're talking about. When you want Liga and build-up play, when you want the Uber Eats discount code, there's no one else that you're going to look for. Husam Awar hugging it out with Memphis Depay. The Leon masterclass performance right there in the scoop turn. Probably the deadliest move inside the box. Maybe maybe even more so than the body faint, to be honest with you. Because the scoop turn, you can, get, leave, you can leave a guy completely in the dust, and it's nowhere near as difficult to execute. See, how does he miss that? 90 finishing, 90 composure. How does that even go near missing the net? Is he getting out of here 66 minute? I don't think he can handle the skills, and he cannot handle the skills. Match number two is a rage quit. Hatem Ben Alpha gets himself another goal. Husam Awar gets another goal, and we put PK on his ass. We got the Mega Pack and the Rare Electrum Players Pack. The Rare Electrum Players Pack is the lesser one. So we're going to go with the Rare Electrum Players Pack. We're going to see what this is first. Um, again, if you're looking for a guy to play striker, even though you saw Hatem Ben Arfa do absolute bits for us in that uh, in the first two matches, um, I, I wouldn't exactly recommend that as the place to play him. You probably want to play him at Cam. You can play him at Lamb, you can play him at Ram if you want. Um, but uh, up top is probably not where you want. Now, 85 Saul, that's not a bad little that's not a bad little pack return. 16,000 coins. Let's go, boys. Polish players, I think that SPC expired, so they're not going for as much as they did before. Um, so we're gonna quick sell the rest of the boys, and then we're gonna go over to our last pack, which is that mega pack. And uh, we're gonna see if this pack has any value in it. It is not gonna be a walkout, but I told you guys at the start that stamina is a little bit crippling. So I am gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna give it one thumbs up. You know, how do we do this? You guys gotta help me with the rating. Maybe someone tweet me and let me know the best way to do this rating system. Give it a three out of five. Uh, just was a little bit underwhelming. Um, from a performance standpoint in terms of just energy and fitness on the pitch and then again the 59 stamina and the fact that we that EA aren't able to go into an individual stat this year and adjust that is a little bit is a little bit soul crushing so um, that is my main that's my main gripe with the card obviously that it has really really st low stamina but for uh, in terms of value perspective not a horrible SBC that is going to do it for the epi hopefully you guys have enjoyed if you did as always if this helped you in some way shape or form drop a cheeky like on the video if you guys are new to the channel hit that subscribe button down below gonna be playing PUBG with the Banner Brothers on Mixer over tonight so probably a couple hours after you see this video will be going live over there but thank you guys for the support you guys are absolute mad lads see you guys for another up tomorrow till next time my bros choose later a day